Hey, what's going on guys? Shannon Stute down at St. Albert Dodge and I get the pleasure of introducing this 2017 uh, Ford Explorer to you. Um, it's not a, a Ford Explorer, it's just an Explorer um, and it's a Ford. So here it is. Uh, nice uh, new design as of, probably couldn't tell you what year, but the Explorer has been one that's been around for a while. So not very informative there, but definitely looks new and, uh, and sharp. So you got the um, park sensing technology on the front, so these will beep at you if you're coming up to any kind of object. Pretty cool little pass through here for aerodynamics. Um, nice big um, painted uh, wheels. I think you're gonna end up with a set of 20s wrapped with uh, Bridgestone rubber, lots of tread there. Also has that nice off-white color with ability to lock and unlock from just touching here. Um, vehicle also is equipped with the keypad technology, which is really great for when you need to uh, maybe go out snowboarding or something like that. Don't want your key sitting in your pocket, hurting your leg if you fall down. Instead, you can use the code to lock your key in the vehicle and then come up and use the code again. Easy way to get in and out of your vehicle without your key. On the inside here, you have an array of different things like the power seat, also has the power, or sorry, the uh, telescopic and raking steering wheel, um, which gives you a lot of different seating comfortability. The other thing that we'll talk about when we get on the inside is this is uh, the um, all-wheel drive capable vehicle. So that gives you um, a different couple of um, terrain selections that you can run through according to the snow or if you're off-road a little bit, that type of thing. Down underneath here, um, we do have a lift gate um, with the third row just here in the back. So easy enough, just one pull of, I think it's the red one, and this will lay down, and then a pull of this uh, black one, and then pull it back. Hang on, I had this figured out. One, two, and then three, and then it folds into the floor. So you got uh, a little extra space for cargo, that type of thing, if you don't need any occupants in the back seat. So, putting that back up, uh, pull the number one, and then pull the seat rest. Oh, both at the same time, that's the trick, just forgot. Let's hop on the inside and check it out. Hey guys, thanks for joining me for the video. Um, we got the big uh, sunroof, uh, I guess it's split in half, so you can call it two, but one for the front, one for the back. Um, just here is our selected terrain, so you can move through these different functions. Um, the mud, the sand, the snow, um, really great features for helping you to um, go ahead and maneuver through uh, the elements that we deal with. You've also got a nice infotainment center, um, which is Ford Sync. I think that they make a really good quality uh, system for when it comes to speaking to it with the voice recognition, um, as well as speaking through your phone and those types of things. Another one that this one has is the um, connected mobile app. So a couple different things you can add there. And then has the um, AM, FM, and Sirius uh, satellite radio capability. Uh, last thing I'll leave you with um, is the kilometers. So 115,000 kilometers. Um, lots of life left as well as lots of heated seat to be sat on. So dual heated seats, front and, uh, uh, sorry, driver and passenger. So yeah, pretty excited for you to come on down and see this vehicle for yourself and take it for a drive. Thank you for your time.